what's up? <laughs> you guys here for UPTV's 21st birthday bash? <laughs> You're just in time to help me make the jungle juice. I got my own special recipe I like to call the Tower's Tower. You guys wanna help me make it? All right, come on, let's go. First things first, you're gonna to wanna to get a handle of the cheapest rum and the cheapest vodka money can buy. My personal favorites are Calico Jack and Crown Roofs, but you can use whatever's available to you at your local fine wine and spirits. Probably the same one that I'm at, because you're also a pit student, and there's only one. Next, you're gonna want two gallon jugs of orange juice, a gallon of pink lemonade, and a gallon of fruit punch. If you want to get a little extra spicy, you can add in a bottle of club soda for that little pizzazz. Finally, garnish it off with your favorite fruits. But slow down there, folks. You're still going to need something to make it in. Which brings me to the eponymous Towers Tub, aka that bin you used to move all your shirts into your dorm room freshman year. But don't forget to disinfect it first. After all, you wouldn't want your punch tasting like shirts. Now that you've got your ingredients, you're ready to make your juice. Let's get pouring. <laughs> We're gonna start with some vodka. Uh -huh. yeah, there we go. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's good, that's good. Next, pink lemonade. Another half gallon or so. Here's the fruit punch. Glow soda. Now that you've added all that, you can give it a nice little stir, really get it all mixed up. And then, we're gonna set this tub on the floor, and we're gonna cut up some fruit. And don't forget to wash your fruit, especially if you drop them on the floor a lot. Bottoms up! Now you're going to want to let that sit for a while. Let the fruit really soak up all the juices. Let it marinate. And just like that, a Towers tub ready to drink. Be sure to get some pieces of fruit in there too. Mm, yeah, look at that. Enough to feed you and 30 of your closest friends and acquaintances. Mmm, delicious. If you're like me, and you're in the middle of a global pandemic, you might be asking yourself, what am I supposed to do with all this liquor? Well, don't worry, because I have another drink that's perfect for one. Yay! So this next drink is perfect for when you find yourself alone on a Friday night for the fourth time in a row. All you need is your favorite gin, and a martini glass, and you can enjoy as best you can given the circumstances. And one extra tip, your tears are a great substitute for olive juice, perfect for a dirty quarantini. Happy birthday, UPTV.